Hello, YouTubers. If you've been following Grumpy Old Man's Complaining About Purolators, here we are the next day. This morning, I spent an hour waiting for Purolator to answer the phone. To, sp to actually speak to a live person and complain. And say yesterday, he had the package in the truck and the lazy ass never even delivered it to the house. They told me 8.30 p.m. was the deadline. 6.45, he's logging off. He's done for the day. Where's my package? It's in your friggin' truck. Deliver it. Do your friggin' job. So this morning, I call and get somebody on the phone. They say, oh, yeah, we'll send a dispatch to him, you know, and say, yeah, right, right. Wasted my friggin' time. Tried to Purolator's online chat. They tell me that a manager will call me back within the hour. Well, it's now uh, almost 4 o'clock, so that's uh, five hours ago, five and a half hours ago. Still no callback. Purolator, you really suck. You're not the mo worth the money that people pay to ship with you. If I had a choice of company I could choose when I order my products through Amazon, I would. We're stuck with these useless people who can't get the package out of the back of their vehicle. I had a friggin' TV sit in the warehouse in Ottawa for six friggin' days because nobody could put it in the back of a truck and get it out here. Now I have packages sitting in the truck three days. It's been in his truck. What are you doing? Driving up the road. Oh, I don't know where he lives. Oh, I think I'll stop and get a bite to eat. Oh, I think I'll stop and visit somebody. Why don't you stop and deliver the package? Useless. So again, another pure later fail. Three days I've been waiting. Package is in the truck as they're driving around the community, but he can't be bothered to drive into my laneway. Idiots.